If you live in Indian cities, you're no stranger to the phrase PM 2.5 or particulate matter 2.5. Face masks that block these particles from entering our body have been a reality for us long before COVID-19. But particulate matter is not a local phenomenon. It's a negative environmental influence that exists everywhere on the planet. Through our series on sustainable cities, we met a group of people in Berlin who are working to solve this problem. Making Berlin livable is best achieved with the help of people who live here. We're using new technology to contribute to better understanding of traffic. I would like to see the city authorities and the general public taking care of the trees. Berlin-based artist Michael Zaub has turned the data into a virtual reality installation. It's on show here at the City Lab, a nonprofit foundation for innovation. The installation visualizes what the sensors record, because particulate matter cannot be seen by the naked eye. These circles show current conditions in virtual reality. If I go over to the other monitor, I can see that same section on a bigger map. And if I now put on my VR visor, it puts me right in the middle of the particulate matter. Over at the Ufa Fabrik, they've been working on green projects for more than 30 years now and are now building sensors for particulate matter. The aim is to increase public awareness of air pollution. Hopefully we'll see people getting involved similarly to Wikipedia and that data being made available to everyone. This innocuous looking sensor has now been replicated hundreds of times by people in Berlin. The hope is that the data can be used to make information about air pollution public and not just in the German capital. Now, air pollution has many faces in India. 